Okay, today I would like to share with you 10 situations that the candidates usually encounter in the examination room of the IELTS speaking test. The first situation, as far as you know, the IELTS speaking test usually takes place in a very hot afternoon. And I suppose that there were 10 candidates before you enter the examination room and made the examiner really disappointed about their speaking ability. So you are the 11th one. And so what do you have to do to create a good emotion and impression for your examiner for the first meeting? The second situation, when you take the IELTS speaking test, do you wonder yourself what the examiner had to base on to score you? And the third situation, can you have a look at the questions and the examiner, sorry, and the answers of the student and the examiner? The questions examiner is, what is your favorite kind of sport? And your answer is ping pong. What kind of music do you like? Country music. And what's your favorite festival? Lunar New Year. And um, why do you like going by bus? Because it's very convenient. So for you, the, how can the examiner evaluate and score you for the, those kind of the answers? Coming to the fourth situation, the examiner is listening to you using a lot of local words and the concept in your answers. Like when you talk about the name of the friend, you say that, oh, I have a good relationship with Nyan. And you talk about the kind of music. My, ki my favorite kind of music is Jiao, and uh, my favorite bird is Se Se, or I really like the movie uh, Sand and Dust. So, in your opinion, for the native English speaker, and now it's your son, is it good enough for him to understand what you are saying when you use a lot of local words? I mean, in the situation, that's in the Vietnamese words. Coming to the fifth situation, you're listening to the questions. Can you describe what did you do on the last weekend? And your answer is, can you listen to me? Well, it was a great day. I went to a really great restaurant. I had a great lunch with my girlfriend. The environment was so great. And they had a great background music and food. From what we said, I really had a great lay view. And after that, we went to see a movie. So the weekend was so great. So in your opinion, is the sound no patient enough to listen to you anymore? The same situation. During the speaking test, you speak very gradually. You don't make any change in your intonation. I mean, your voice is going on very straight. You don't make any up and down. You don't make any change. So, do you know what the sounder is thinking of? He is or she is thinking that you're learning by heart a modern test. The seventh situation. The question is, what's your audio job? And you answer as, Oh, well, you know, I'm a student, so at the moment, I have a no job. So I don't know whether the answer can meet to the needs of the questions. And I wonder, the examiner is wondering your, yeah, whether you understand the words ideal or not. And the eighth situation, not really yourself, but a lot of people make mistakes for this kind of situation. The question is, do you like music? And the way you answer is, oh, I like music very much. Uh, I often listen to uh, English music. Uh, Sometimes I listen to pop music because uh, it's a, a very comfortable and interesting. I feel uh, very relaxing when uh, I listen to it. Is it good enough for this kind of answer? The examiner is here to understand you or want to listen to you anymore or not when you make a lot of interruption by saying mm -hmm. Okay? Coming to the ninth situation, the examiner is waiting for you to present the reason why you like the change. And your answer is, well, uh, I like the change very much. Last summer vacation, I took the change to Kenya province. When the train was coming out of the tunnel, well, the sunshine was shining up my body and very fresh my show. I felt that 
are very interesting and very fresh. So I felt very good. It seemed to be I was one again. Okay. So I like the chain very much. Is this a good answer? The sound that are patient enough is patient enough to listen to you anymore or not. The last situation that usually you encounter in the salvation room. The examiner is listening to you to talk about a female friend and your answer is Oh well, I'm gonna talk about my my girlfriend He is very nice, he often help me when I have difficulties We often go out for listening to music When I have a trouble, she often share with me She likes shopping very much and me too So, do you know what the examiner is wondering? He's wonder that he's wondering that you're talking about a female or male friend. So above are all ten situations that I just share with you. Hope that it can help you with a better information and experience.